Hello and welcome back. It's Fessy here from P4C. By the time this video comes out, it would be the end of August, uh, which means this will be the last video for August. Uh, so today we are going huge. We are going large. Excellent. As you could tell from the thumbnail, we are opening some vintage packs today. Packs that are dated back in 1999, none other than the Neo Genesis packs. In fact, we are going to open not one, not two, not three, but four Japanese Neo Genesis packs today, along with some crowd favorites uh, that just came out in the 2010s. Before we crack on to the opening today, as this is the last video of the month, I just want to take this chance to thank everyone once again. Uh, it has been four months since we started this channel. It has been an amazing journey. We're growing steadily, and I wanted to thank all the returning viewers week in week out uh, for enjoying and watching all of our content now if you're new to the channel uh, this particular channel will always aim to provide you guys the latest review in terms of the pokemon card set and boy we've got a big one coming up in september because we got astonishing vault tackle the newest set in japanese as well as the newest uh, holiday set champions path in english coming both in September. So guys, make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't already done so. Most importantly, hit that bell for the latest videos and updates. All right guys, without further ado, let's open some vintage packs today. All right guys, like we said, we're going huge, we're going big, we're going large today. Uh, you can see here, we've got this amazing shining legend special collection box the zora gx box we're going to smash that open today uh we are also going to open some xy fierce fists here and then we are also going to open some my favorite sun and moon set uh beside hidden fate which is the cosmic eclipse and of course the main dish for today which is these neo genesis japanese packs dated back from 1999. All right, let's do this. Alrighty, uh, you can see here we've got some Furious Fists. So I'm going to actually open this particular, these particular, or this particular set first. So uh, Furious Fists, I think came out in 2014, if I remember correctly. Let's have a look at the cards. Uh, 2014, that's correct. So I think the chase card for this particular set here is indeed the uh um now oh we've got a basic in here what's going on did i do the card trick wrong it's 10 cards right um i did four cards and then uh, i've got the uh basic in here what's going on so i've got a reverse sorry i've got a holo card first up here so we might have done the card trick wrong uh, might have done three cards we've got a watchdog here jaw fossil sparkling rope clancher Mean food, bell sprout, gullet. Did I do the card trick wrong? I think I might have. So we've got electrovite here, which is a reverse hollow. So let's just put that there. I definitely would have done the card trick wrong then, if that's the case. Uh, throwing myself off a little bit here. I was trying to describe the uh, the chase card for this set, and the Pokemon name is escaping. Uh, my name at the moment. All right, second pack here. I might actually need to go and search it out. Uh, here's the code card for everyone. I don't even know if these code card works or not. Now, four cards, right? I did four cards. I did four cards before, I'm pretty sure. So again, this is Electrovite. So it must have got it wrong then. Uh, Electrovite again, uh, pretty much the similar. I'm just gonna list through this now because uh, we did the card trick wrong. So. Maybe just three cards. So we've got Shellman Reverse there. Um, and then we've got Electrovite here. So it might be just a, a three cards. Card trick then. I'm really confused now. I'm really confused. Um, all right, third pack here. A bit of a nostalgic here. Nostalgia, nostalgic, nostalgia here. Um, opening up these cards here. I'm not, again, not sure if this, all right. Should we do three cards? I think it's three cards. I'm gonna have a look, three cards. 
three cards is better. I think it is three cards. Oh, I'm just really... Ah, because there's no energy cards here. That's why it's three cards. All right, Watchdog here, Pancham, um, Shroomish, Pancham again, Pikachu, uh, Magma, Pogoro, and then... Set me taught EX, and it is so off-center, like you wouldn't believe it, which is... Uh, like I said, Sesame Todd is a very underrated Pokemon, guys, in the actual, uh, not the TCG game, but the um, the uh, the actual Pokemon game itself. But it is very off-centered, the top and the bottom, even the sides, very off-centered. But nonetheless, very, very nice card. It's one of the uh, Pokemon I under underratedly like. Is there such thing? Underratedly like. So, uh, it's going to get some sleeps here. It, these cards are, uh, in fact, from very very long time ago uh so might sleep that up it's very nice from just from our third pack there all right i just went and did a bit of research now the reason i keep forgetting the name is uh, uh, there's a valid reason why uh those the secret rare is heracross and the pokemon that i keep forgetting the name is actually lucario now you're thinking lucario is such a popular pokemon how can i forget the name the point and the problem, in the fact, is uh, I've been trying to watch a few episodes of the latest Pokemon Pokemon Journey uh, in Japanese uh, with English sub, and Ash at the moment has a Rylou, and I well, the name Rylou keep coming up in my head, and I just like oh well, well it's not called Ryle Rylou, well anyway it's not called Rylou right, so I just can't get the name out of my head. Uh, anyway, we've got a Pikachu here, and then we've got a Gothy Tail, uh, just a normal holo card, sorry, normal rare card, but you can see in some of these old cards, the cards are really bad, um, you can see the, uh, the side, of the, totally off-centered, this card is so totally off-centered, so, alright, well, I'm glad that they're definitely making the, uh, the quality a little bit better, because we are now revisiting uh, one of my favorite set in Sun and Moon, and I, I think very underrated here, uh, which is the Cosmic Eclipse. So four card, card trick should be right because we do have energy cards here. Uh, now, this is the same booster box that we open and pull a Rainbow Rare. So I don't know where, what, where, what, how we should expect here. We've got, just got a wheezing here, so um, maybe there's more. Maybe there's a gold card here, who knows? Um, so I'm just opening up four um, because, you know, I love opening these packs and um, I, I actually um, really miss opening up packs when I am not filming. So I, I got it again, the special rule that I'm not allowed to open packs unless I'm filming for the channel. So. I get a bit of a redrawn sometimes, just like because I have obviously packs behind me uh, and I have packs in the draw, so I get a little bit of redrawn sometimes. Okay, all right, we've got a Roxy here, and then from the top, we've got a Druglish, Druglish, Druglish here. Yeah. So nothing there. Two more packs of Cosmic Eclipse, and then we're gonna bust the uh, Shining Legend box open. Bust the Shining Legend box and then we're gonna leave the main event, main dish last, okay? Um, Alright, we've got a Psychic Energy. So, it's a bit of an update in terms of the channel as well for September. Um, I've been saying this a lot, we've got a huge September coming up. So, most of September will be dedicated to the new sets that are coming out. We've got a Lone Fall Pixie, uh, and then we've got a Flygon GX, which I don't think I have this card yet. Very nice. We've got a Flygon GX here. Um, but we've got a bit of a void to fill in the start of September, and I'm still scratching my head as to what to do. So uh, we definitely will be doing some hunting Charizard series. Um, I think we might squeeze one in two. We will do another Vintage Packs opening. So Vintage Packs opening will be dedicated at the end of the month uh, so we'll do that we'll do the four languages packs opening as well uh, we've got gems from Japan uh, as well I think we only maybe only have one episode from gems from Japan just try to cut down 
spending too much money. Hey, we've got a Weevil here. I don't, I'm not sure if I got this card yet. So this is the Secret Rare, and then we've got a Drag part there. All right, just clear some space so we can uh, open the uh, the special collection box here. How are we going to do this? I am going to actually demolishing the box. This box is. Uh, um, got a few sticker mark on it and, and whatnot, so that's why I decided to open it and I can be a little bit, well, I can be not gentle with it, I guess. That's what I'm trying to say. So, let's try to open here. We've obviously got a jumbo card here. We've got the, uh, we've got the promo cards here and they are, in fact, in shiny version as well in the hidden face. So, uh, let's just leave those aside because they are typically very hard to get out. So, but these packs aren't, so let's get all of these out and code card for those who are playing at home i'm gonna leave the coin and the uh and the jumbo right there all right we've got five packs of shining legend haven't opened shining legends for a very very long time i think about two or three months now so uh, i'm gonna try to leave this mew pack last and let's just go through with it all uh, we're gonna start with mew and end with a mew so uh the chase card for this particular set is the, uh, the Mewtwo in a test tube, in a test lab, uh, and of, of course, all those shining, uh, shining Pokemon. Now, I'm gonna do, I haven't opened this for so long, so I'm gonna do three cards first. F four cards, so four, four cards, so we've got an energy card here, so it is four cards, so sorry about that. Uh, energy revised. So like I was saying uh, in September, we've got a few things, and then I'm gonna try to squeeze in something new as well, and actually it is not, Pokemon card related because uh, I saw a, someone done this in a very long time ago uh, and I'm intrigued so I want to do it on my channel too so hopefully you guys will enjoy that oh we've got a holo various varies on and then we've got a scrappy here so we've got a hit in our first pack we've got a hit in our first pack uh, yeah, so, and we are actually running a, uh, interesting competition as well, running a very, very interesting competition in September as well, so you guys stay tuned, that will be announced in our first September video, how it all works. Very energy here, card vines, which, a Venusaur, lovely Venusaur card here, Zongfisk, Puzzle, Perlin, Golet, Pokemon Breeder, come on, on the top, a Mush Shadow Holo card there, so we've done okay, I think, we've done okay so far, we, uh, we, two from two, two from two, alright, it'll be really cool if we can pull the Shining Recrazer here, so one of the chase card here, Shining Recrazer, Shining Mew, uh, one, two, three, four there, again, I haven't opened up a lot of uh shining legend so i'm i you i would say i'm not that too familiar with this set it is a holiday set so to speak and actually a one of the smaller set in in sun and moon so it does make it a little bit more easier to collect all right scraggy here and then from the bottom we've got a raikou hollow card there all right is it me Oh, every card is is hollow. Every every rare card is hollow. So we've got three hollow card here. Two more packs of shining legend to go. Uh, from memory, uh, we did pull a uh, shining genesec, shining genesec uh, from one of our last opening when we last opened this set. So let's see if we uh, get some luck here. Bulbasaur, Tortodile. That's a very nice looking Tortodile, by the way. Uh, Pikachu, Ekans, Voltor, we've got a Boozel, and then from the bottom, we've got a Mewtwo GX, so first GX hit here, alright, last pack, let's see if we can gonna get some Shining Pokemon, yeah, last pack of the Shining Legends, here's the code card, one, two, three, four, all right, we did get a hit. We did get a Mewtwo here. It would have been really exciting if we actually have got the uh, the test tube Mewtwo as well. A Toro Cat, Puzzle, Jinx, Croconaut, Scraggy. This card has come up so many times. And then we've got a La Vesta from the top. Oh, 
Come on! We got a Pokemon breeder. It's trainer cart. Full art trainer cart there. Alrighty, just as a quick recap before we jump into the Neo Genesis packs. We've got, we from the Shining Legend, we pull a Mewtwo and we pull a Pokemon breeder. Uh, and then from the Cosmic Clears, we pulled a Reveal and a Flygon. And then from the XY Furious Fist, we pulled a very, very off center Sesame Todd EX card. All right. Here it is, here are the four packs. Uh, again, not sure if you guys remember these. These were from uh, the Gems from Japan series. Uh, so yes, they are tempered, they are open. The, and yes, I have, haven't have checked what the cards are inside, but I have checked that these cards are all in there. Uh, so, and then we actually opened some uh, in our live stream as well, I believe, in our live stream where we pull a Typhlosion. Now the Japanese version of the Typhlosion Probably not as stat sought out as the uh, English version, but uh, we did manage to pull that. So each pack is guaranteed. Is guaranteed. I'm pretty sure is guaranteed a hollow card. Uh, so and I think uh, is this card right at the top here. So again, I haven't had a sneak peek of what these cards are, so I have no idea what the hollow card is. Uh, so for this set. The chase card is, of course, the Lugia. The Lugia card, uh, because it's the first time... Oh, we've got an energy card. Did I do the card trick wrong? We've got an energy card here. Um, no, hold on, I'm scared I did the e tr card trick wrong now. The, uh, sorry. The, uh, the Lugia is the first time Lugia obviously appeared because this is the gold and silver. Uh, and yeah, so it is the first ever Lugia card here. It's the chase card here. Did I do the card trick wrong? Uh, I did do the card trick wrong. Sorry, we've got a metal energy there. Um, so I did do the card trick wrong. Oh my god, what did I do there? All right, so here we go. That was the first pack, guys. That was the first pack there. So I'm gonna just put these aside and put that here. So these um, these packs, these packs actually came out. In 1999, which is even earlier than the English Neo uh, Destiny pack. So I'm gonna see if I did the card trick right. No, okay, sorry. This one here is the hollow, so we're in the wrong way. We're in the wrong way. All right, no, what the hang on, what's going on? We've got a uh, so it's not guaranteed a, a, a hollow card every pack, is it? So because we've got a rare cut here, which is a weasel, weevil, weevil rare. Oh my god, I'm confused now. Uh, Arados, Whoopa, a trainer cut. Oh, this is so nostalgic here. And then we've got a Kinomi, which is a fruit, I think. We've got a Pokemon March there. We've got a Grand Ball, and then we've got a here we go. Oh, I did it right. I did it right. All right. I can't believe that was too. Hello there, but uh, we've got a, a very, very off-center Slow King, uh, Yado King, Yado King, which is the Japanese name there. We've got a, it's very, very off-center, by the way, from left to right. So, all right, no Lugia there, no Lugia there. We're gonna open up another pack now. Oh, I saw the card already. I shouldn't have opened it like that. So, I'm not sure if you guys saw it, but we'll go for it anyway. Um, Again, a Weevil, and again, we've got Oddish here. Uh, that name exp just escaped me. Um, Slowpoke. Uh, got a Fruit here again. We've got Natu, a Grandbo again. And then we did see this card, which is the uh, Steel X, which is Hageneru. Hageneru. So, oh, the whole, these are pack fresh and looks so good. Uh, in terms of the holographics. All right, opening up one more pack. Our chance to uh, to get this uh, Lugia card. I, again, I, I'm, you know, maybe these cards are tempered for a reason. Maybe the guy who had these sort of just cut them open and then say, oh, no Lugia, I'm gonna put, store them back and then wait 20 years later and then sell them. So maybe, maybe that's what has happened as I am struggling to open this pack here. 
Uh, because we don't want to ruin the surprise. We want to. We want to. We don't want to ruin the surprise here. Oh, even if this card is the Lugia, look at the off center on these cards. Very, very off center from the back. All right, we've got a trainer card here. Uh, Energy charge challenge charge. Uh, Stelia, st st Stelia. Um, oh, we got a Cedra. Uh, all these cards here, we're gonna, you know, Fampi, Whoppa, very off-centered these cards. We've got a rope, we got a Bayleaf, and the last card is this, the, another energy card. <laughs> a very, very off-centered energy card again. So we've got two metal energy, we've got a Slow King, and then we've got a Steel Axe. Alright guys, there it is. Uh, that was the Vintage Packs opening. Hope you guys enjoyed this particular video. Make sure you give us a like if you did enjoy this video or any of our other content. Uh, make sure you subscribe and then after you subscribe, make sure you give us a like. Guys, it has been an unbelievable four months and thank you everyone who has continuously to come back and watch and enjoy our content. We have more of these coming up in September. Massive September coming up. So guys, see you guys soon.